Kansas City City Hall is the official seat of government for the city of Kansas City, Missouri. Located in downtown, it is a 29-story skyscraper with an observation deck. Completed in 1937, the building has a Beaux-Arts and Art Deco style with numerous architectural features and an ornamentation throughout. One Kansas City place was modeled as an 80s version of City Hall, and is the tallest building in Kansas City. Situated on a city block bounded by E. 11th Street, E. 12th Street, Oak Street, and Locust Street, this 29-story structure was designed by White and White in the neoclassic and Beaux-Arts architectural style and built to replace and expand an earlier city hall. It is the third city hall since the incorporation of the city of Kansas in 1853. Construction of the building lasted for 22 months and the concrete was supplied by then-political boss Tom Pendergast. Its location has served as the center of city government since 1937. When it was completed, it was the tallest building in the city. It is currently the third tallest building in the city and one of the tallest city halls in the United States. The exterior features Indiana limestone. There is an underground parking garage that extends under the south lawn. Several types of marble were used to enhance the building's interior design and beauty, including Pyrenees marble from southwestern France, travertine marble from Tivoli, Italy, and Verde antique marble from Vermont, among others. Some of the woods used were oak and walnut. The total cost of construction was approximately $6 million and far exceeded the $4 million bond monies allotted for the project. The building is notable for its Art Deco details and ornamentation. This is particularly evident within the building. As visitors enter the building, they are greeted with elaborate marble stairways and bronze architectural features honoring the history of Kansas City from its inception to the present. There are a myriad of interior details, including sculpted brass elevator doors depicting the four major modes of transportation that serve Kansas City, elaborate light fixtures in the lobby and elsewhere, and even custom brass doorknob plates. The seahorse fountains on the south side of City Hall. The statue of Abraham Lincoln and his son Tad on the south side of City Hall. At the top of the six-story base on the exterior of the building, windows are replaced with a frieze of relief sculptures depicting the early settlement and growth of the Kansas City area. Sculptures on the exterior of the building include those by C. Paul Genuine, Ulrich Ellerhusen, and Walker Hancock. There are several notable people and places included in the panels of the building including Senator Thomas Hart Benton, Benoist Troost, Kersey Coates, Lewis and Clark, the Chateau Trading Post, and the Santa Fe Trail, among others. To the south of the building are fountains with two ornamental seahorses, dolphins, and seashells. City employees named the seahorses Lug and Cut soon after the fountain's dedication. They were named for lugs of the political machine and cuts in pay experienced by city workers in the 1930s. There is also a statue of Abraham Lincoln and his son Tad, sculpted by Lorenzo Gilieri. The top floor of the building features an observation deck which provides free viewings with weather and security permitting. Thanks for watching.